These are the best watch straps for summer. So summer here in Austria is in full swing. We have had multiple days with temperatures above 30 degrees Celsius. And what is the best thing to do when it's this hot? Well, obviously, if you can, jump into a pool, a lake, or even the ocean if it's near to you. And what do you need for that? Well, if you're going to wear a watch, you're going to need the perfectly matching watch strap. So today I have compiled three of my favorite watch strap categories to wear during summer. Let's start right off with the obvious choice, rubber straps. Rubber straps are the perfect companion during summer. They are firstly very durable, and secondly, they're waterproof, meaning that they will not soak themselves with water when being in contact with it. And you can easily clean them off, wipe them off with your towel, and they're instantly dry. For this category, I chose the Hirsch Nyad watch strap. I will have links to the watch straps down below. The Hirsch Nyad is one of my favorite watch straps currently. It took us approximately one and a half years to develop it, and I've been wearing it since the idea came up. I've tested this watch strap. I've taken it into the ocean, into multiple pools, and it's been just such a fantastic companion. It's lightweight, it lets air through, and it's super comfortable on the wrist. It hugs your wrist like no other watch strap can. This is my choice for this summer and you will see me wearing multiple different colors of this particular watch strap a lot. The second category that I'd like to talk about are hybrid watch straps. Most of the times they are a combination between rubber and other materials like leather, recycled ocean PET, textiles, even caoutchouc at some times. I picked this category because it's very similar to the first one as they are also very water resistant. The rubber core obviously is waterproof and the upper material just soaks itself with very little water or none if it has a repellent finish on it and therefore it's also very durable. You can take it for a swim in any occasion, being at the ocean or the pool, whatever you want and what you prefer and it dries very fast as well. With hybrid straps you have multiple different kinds of style options to go for. You have potential different kinds of leathers to choose from, different kinds of colors to choose from. You can choose different kinds of materials as textiles or even different kinds of motifs if you're into it. For me, this range is more of a combination in terms of everyday wear. If you need something for the office and then might go to the gym or for a swim afterwards, you don't have to necessarily change the strap. I personally pick colors here. The strap that I chose is our Anne strap. It's a combination between our caoutchouc rubber core and a recycled ocean PT on top. It's a nice textile that feels great and it has this tactile aesthetic. It's available in multiple colors and for the sake of it and as it's summer, I picked the turquoise version. It's just fun. It matches the color of our Lake Wörthersee here in Klagenfurt perfectly. Last but not least, there's one more category I'd like to talk about. And this is not particularly the category that you think. I'm going to go for colorful watch straps. Not necessarily super waterproof or super water resistant, just colorful and fun. You could either pick the Osiris Nubuk that we have in different kinds of colors if you like more of a suede aesthetic. They will also be easy to wear. Bear in mind they are not as resistant as other kinds of watch straps. Or if you have a gold watch, let's say you have a Patek Calatrava, why not go for a very elegant calf leather watch strap like our Bologna. We have it in different kinds of colors, in different kinds of sizes, and you can even pick up a turquoise one if you want. So that's it. That are the three main categories of summer watch straps that I could recommend to you. What is your favorite? Put it down in the comments below and let me know what watch are you going to wear this summer. If you want to watch two other strap guides, here are two videos for you to check out. And as always, don't forget to subscribe, leave a like. See you in the next one. Bye-bye.